hi to Chaco. We have a death type. The death type he is level one still. He crept this. Is this the first creep camp he crept? I think so. He has a skeleton wand. He is. Uh, he went fast. Death knight, slow fiends. There's his first fiend. We have an illusion over there. We have a acolyte over there. The blade master is creeping this with a grunt. He. Oh, what is this? Three circlets. How many of those did he buy? One. Just one. So he got one circlet from here. He bought the circlet from here, and he gets another one here over here. That's so amazingly good. In this matchup, you want the surplus, so he's so happy right now. Pinga is finally gonna win a game. Finally. And here we get a replenishment potion. No sense rewards. So he's gonna be sad. And a Blade Master gets a close off attack. This is nice. Okay, he's going for the ghoul. The ghoul. Can he micro the ghoul? This ghoul. It's only this ghoul that he's attacking. Hello. Uh, yes, is he in time? Oh, he's in time. 120 almost lost the game there. He summoned some skeletons. Use the replenishment potion. He's creeping this creep camp. <laughs> if you put your head on the side, there's a. Uh, what trains base is a smiley face. Look. This building is the left eye. This building is the right eye. This building is the nose. And this is some kind of mouth with uh, the gold mine being like a golden teeth sticking out. Or maybe a pimple. Or maybe. What could it be? His tongue? I nah yeah no not really his tongue right. I don't know, but it looks it looks pretty nice. That's a nice smiley face. Sleeper awaits the death knight here is level two. He has a, a death knight illusion death knight over there, the bait master. Still has the same items as he had before because the overseer is still alive. But he can have, get two more circles from this one and from the overseer here. It's gonna be beautiful. Meanwhile, the fiends here creeping the murlocs. This fiend takes a lot of damage, 150 hit points. Clock of shadows. He needs more water. He's seeing things. I'm sure you guys see the same. Oh, this fiend! Hello, I see a fiend dying. A spooky, a spooky spider dying. Once you see it. It's crying. Oh wait, he got a third eye. What the fuck? What is, what is this building? A necropolis. Uh, he has three eyes now. Wait, he's crying? I mean, the, the units are, are the crying, I guess, the droplets. And he has some crumbles here. Or is that also... Uh, what the fourth eye? Now it's getting a, a kind of weird. This is getting weird. I'm feeling a little bit awkward now looking at his face. Spider face. Oh, it's a spider face. Someone tell 120 to unsummon those buildings. He can still just cancel them. Doesn't even need to unsummon. By the way, the second Necropolis is pretty nice. But I don't know why he builds it here. Why not build it somewhere more aggressively? Are you just afraid that it doesn't have defense? I guess 120 is just not an artist. That's why uh, his, his base doesn't look that beautiful anymore. What do we have here? Um, wait, did someone kill the ogre earlier already? No, here it is. Warstone Battle Drums, insanely good item. Best item probably for Orc. Um, yeah, maybe. Or the Unholy Aura might be better. But this is, uh, no, I think this is probably better. Now creeping over here, he gets a nice wad of mana ceiling. Why second necropolis? Uh, so you can, you know, build acolytes. There's a lich. If he loses acolytes in a base racer or something, if he loses his main to a base racer or something, it's just good for base race type of situations. It does give 10 food, but so does a ziggurat. But it's, uh, yeah, the difference is compared to a ziggurat, it's uh, about 100 more gold, uh, 50 less lumber. He has plenty of lumber, so it's not, uh, he didn't build it to save lumber. Our forces are under attack. Oh, he finds the acolyte. But it's just, uh, it's at 1500 hit points. The ziggurat only has like 550. 
and you can TP to it. So if uh, if you lose one main, you can always TP to the other one. Let's kill the ogre. There's a dark ranger. Oh, the blade master gets it, and also top of XP is now almost level four. Kills his other berserker as well. This ogre magi, do we have dust? Blade master even picked up that item. Such good skills here by the Blade Master. He didn't get XP. By the way, this also gives a lot more blight. Another advantage here of building this necropolis here in the front. Okay, um, 41 spike against 47. Pinga actually in not a bad position here. Did so well with the oh, mana stone. Did so uh, well with the blade master. The mana stone. Who's gonna pick that up? This uh, statue takes so much damage. He goes down. Blade master level four now. Wyvern is dead. Nice uh, coil. There's another Kodo or first Kodo. He, he tries to defeat, but the uh, fiend walks away. This fiend uh, was totally dead, by the way. The TC coming uh, in to help. Do we have a dark ranger? Oh yeah, we do have one over there. Uh, nice frost armor there on the lich. What's he going for? For the lich? Where's the coil? There's another coil. He has the info potion as well. The shadow under in trouble. He's surrounded by skeletons. And his TC, his own TC. The shadow under does go down. But the lich is probably going to die as well. Because now was the blade master. He dies. Our hero, Our hero has been killed. Okay, nice. Uh, he tries to kill this grunt. There's a lich in back. The ancient evil survived. Shit. And the blade master takes some damage. Do we have Frost Nova? No, because he just came back without mana. Oh, this grunt is, is surrounded by skeletons, or kinda. He goes down. Level 4 Death Knight now. Ooh. Ooh. 44 spike is 44. Someone please pick up the greater mana potion. You mean the mana stone? Well, the blade master. Might see it. He picks it up. That's what you were talking about, right? There's no greater mana potion, no. Uh, the grunt here, and just walking home. Dark Rangers level 2, Death Knight level 4, Lich level 2. With two Kodos, what is this? This? Maybe a few Kodos too many? Like, you don't have a single Raider. Okay, now he's getting the Ensnare upgrade and the Raider. He's also getting Berserkers. Shadow Hunter is almost level 3. Level 3 would be nice. The Lich here is uh, level 2 and a half. The Granger level 2. Great, they're gonna creep some more. We have a Death Knight scouting over here. We have a Skeleton trying to kill the Orc army by himself, starting with his Headhunter. He's doing a nice job, but uh, he's going down. Ah. Close of haste here on the Lich. And he also has the Lionhorn of Stormwind. Oh, we will get this ogre! Well, the, item, the kill went to Orc, but the item went also to him. Right, Blade Master. Kantikar's Pipe of Inside! Ooh. That would have been really good for 120. For, uh, for Pinga, it's just good. Our forces are under attack. It's just... Uh, since he already has the Warstrong Battle Drums and the Endurance Aura. Actually, I think the uh, Unholy Aura would have still been better, but the second best item. This uh, this statue takes a lot of damage, can he kill it? He kills it. There's a Dust. Blade Ma the DC and the Blade Master are silenced. He's going for this. Oh, sh the Blade Master takes some damage. He's going for this Fiend. And a nice stun there. On the Death Knight. Uh, can he get the Death Knight? Death Knight TP's out. He's looking pretty bad for a 120. Can he actually lose a game against Pinga? Is this actually a possibility? I think we're seeing this possibility now uh, come to fruition. <laughs> it might be possible. There's a Cloak of Shadows on the ground. And uh, he's gonna creep here. Pinga's gonna creep here. Today I tried to steal Phoenix Axe with the Spellbreaker, didn't work. <laughs> That's too bad. 
Illusions do cancel cells. Yeah, for some reason they do. If, even though they don't do any damage. Research complete. Our forces are under attack. Uh, oh, what a nice item! Field of accuracy for 120. That's a really good one. He has a level three lich as well, and a level almost level three dark ranger as well. Here we just have a level two TC, level three shadow hunter with infinite mana, and level four blade master with plus 27 damage. Thanks to the codas though. Of course, the coda has a fiend in his stomach, so uh, 120 sees everything. See the mana of the Shadow Hunter isn't even going up that fast. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Death Knight uh, or Lich still goes faster with the uh, statue. One, uh, yeah, I think so. Here comes the Shadow Hunter. 50 spike is 49. He kills the creep. He has a level 3 Dark Ranger, but she's a crap. And the uh, coil there on the the thing, the fiend. She, what skill does he have? Level two silence. Okay, level two silence. There's a silence on the blade master and the TC. This uh, fiend takes so much damage. Blade master has to be careful. He has a TP though. Fiend goes down. Blade master TP's out. And this raider is probably going to die before. Yeah, he TP's out. Research complete. The codes are all empty, right? Yeah. Why don't expose? Uh, just playing without expose. We have a shop there, so you probably will expo. You can't. I feel like this this matchup usually on nor most normal maps, like maybe not Serena stand, but most uh, maps, you can't just build an expansion. You have to get an advantage. If one of the players uh, tries to build an expansion, they just lose. There's no timing. There's no expansion timing in this matchup. Is Murdoch's all dying? But maybe, uh, well, Ping is going for it now. Uh, Ping did have some positions in this game where he was ahead. So maybe he could have pulled it off. He goes for it now. I don't think you can steal uh, ultimates with the uh, spellbreakers. I don't think you can do anything with the ultimate summons. You cannot dispel them. You cannot mind control them even with uh, Sylvanas. You cannot sell them with the alchemist ultimate. You cannot do anything to them. They're just completely immune. Well, 59 spike and 50. Uh, 120 has a supply advantage now. And abomination, okay. You have to be careful, it doesn't get eaten though by the Kodo. Yeah, the items are so good for Pinga. It's it's insane. TC not level three yet, but he will be level three pretty soon if he gets some uh, kills. He also, he started the game out uh, with a bunch of circlets, right? He has four circlets, two on the TC, two on the Blade Master. Those are really good in this matchup as well. So uh, yeah, the, oh, this shop is actually not a great position. Uh, he's now moving behind the shop. The shop is now just funneling his own units. And well, we have a fight here, the Blade Master. Oh, we have a chicken, uh, Dark Ranger. The Kodo oh, eats his abomination, but the Kodo's done Michael back fast enough. So he goes down pretty fast. The Dark Ranger, uh, the Lich has to use the Info Potion. The second Kodo also dead is minus 20% damage. Oh, no, never mind, he survived. I was about to say minus 20% damage on the entire orc army, but uh, he's still standing strong in the background, playing his drum. The blade master going for his statue makes sense. Death Knight now level five. The radar goes down. It seems like if this is just a, a normal fight, uh, 120 is just going to win the game. I think our orc Pinga should go for a hero kill or something. TC is uh, using info potion. He goes for the fiend. Blade master coils the fiend. The fiend is still fine. Shadow Hunter uh, in the back, use a heal wave. Okay, and he retreats. You have one tower up, uh, the shop's going down, then the tower is going down, and then uh, the peons are going down, and then the blade master goes down. And then we'll see you GG. Oh, this ghoul almost dies, he retreats. He's gonna buy, he buys a berserker, okay. Doesn't have a coda, oh, he has a coda, never mind, so. He does a lot of damage, the blade master kills a fiend. Plus 29 damage, but he's dead. And 
a bomb that uh, I mean the TC is uh, right and this is something I talk about it so often the mana on, the sh on these heroes I mean I, I don't talk about it enough but I do talk about it very often the mana on these heroes in this matchup is just not the game winners right the TC had like over 250 mana at the end of the when when the game is over the game there's no right thing that cannot win anymore so even though in most other matchups as orc uh shadow hunter the mana on the shadow hunter determines if you win the game or not in this matchup it's not that important it's uh, more important to just let your hero survive so you need the circlets for extra hit points Rune Bracers is better than Sobi Mask, etc. Going for this uh, Voodoo Launch. Connect Banshees. Adapt Banshees. Twenty supply difference. The hero levels are also better for 125, four, and four. Here we have. Four, three, and three. He's going for the base race, but we have the second Necropolis here in place. People are wondering why second Necropolis. Well, you see the base race. Gives the orb of lightning to the TC. Interesting. Uh, I'm not sure why. Blade Masters. Oh, he doesn't want the first uh, hex bunny. I see. Just for this one bunny. Uh, he kills the bunny. There's a TP to this Necropolis. He can also uh, TP now a bit. He has more range to where to TP, of course, because he has two town halls to TP to. Uh, there's some miss, miss by the Shadow Hunter. Blade Master, go for the Dark Ranger. Do we have coil? We have coil. There's a coil. Blade Master is going down fast. He has an info potion. Does the Dark Ranger have one? No. So you better be careful. There's another stomp. And Dark Ranger does go down. I guess the game is not over yet. Well, it probably is, but uh, it looks like it's not over yet. This abomination gets another stomp. We're out of mana on the Death Knight. And the abomination does go down. The Death Knight, he's next. Where's the Frost Armor? He gives him the Info Potion. Uh, he's not using it. Can he eat the Raccoon? There's the Info Potion. Can 120 still lose this game? <laughs> he is so much uh, ahead in supply, but his heroes. Okay, no, his Death Knight should be fine. Okay. He's, he's fine. Right. Research complete. Our forces are under attack. Forces are under attack. Chaco House Life. Life. I haven't seen him play recently. I think he's uh, he's playing on some Smurf yeah, account. So I don't know. It's level four. Death Knight used something to heal back up. Here's a Blade Master. Here's the TC. That's a stomp. There goes a fiend. Our gold mine has collapsed. Our gold mine has collapsed. There's a destroyer as well. TC is is fine. No one cares about the TC taking some damage there. He's gonna be just fine. Oh, I could have sworn about 21 it. Yeah, he's still going to win it, right? Just gonna take a little bit. I mean, how are things going? Oh, you mean you don't mean <laughs> don't mean the player life? Uh, yeah, pretty good. You know, I'm just doing my thing. Like I'm just streaming every day. Just not much. There's not much else uh, going on in my life. My uh, stream is going good. I'm here as always. I'm here as always. Level 5 Death Knight, level 4 Lich, level 4 Dark Ranger, what is this? Boneyard. Oh, he's going for a Boneyard. He's going for one Frost Worm, then he will unsummon it. Uh, I bet I bet you he will unsummon it. We'll get some uh, some shades as well. There's no expansion. He, he, can, he has all the time in the world to do whatever he wants. Actually, this gold mine not empty yet.
So we have some, uh, yeah, we have some downtime so we can talk about life. So what else do I do besides streaming, right? What else do I do? I have to make more emotes. I still have four, four to six emotes slots so, uh, left over. Four normal ones and then one for the $10, one for the $25 slot. Uh, I don't care about those two too much, but at least the four normal ones I should make. I'm thinking one of them I'll uh, use Chico maybe, my cat. But I don't just want his, his face, right? Like, oh yeah, this is just another uh, regular cat emote. Like, there's no no meaning. So I want to put it, give it some more meaning. Uh, may, be a little bit original with my cat emote, but I don't know what yet. Right? Oh, for example, like the cool cat, that one is an original one. It has a sunglass. It's a good one, you know? So what do I do with my cat? Do I put sunglasses on my cat? Well, that's not very original either. Maybe I'll put a hat on, on his uh, on his hat. Did you get Twitch partnership? Yes. Uh, also, I need to upload my three month uh, sub bash, of course. I'm I made it. It's pretty much done. I'm not quite satisfied with it, but you know what? I'm not gonna spend more time on it. Uh, I'll. Yeah, I'm just not an artist, you know. And maybe at some point I have to make my six month bash. Oh, we have a fight here. Bless it under that. Uh, we have a frost worm. The air, the, the radar goes down. Uh, and well, the frost worm is kind of like a fourth hero. It's like a, a second lich. So the frost worm is pretty strong. We see that every orc unit is cursed. We have two codas and eight fiends. So that's pretty nice here by Pinga. The Pinga is losing everything. He just has a Blade Master here uh, doing good work, but besides that, the TC actually uses Info Potion. It's just two heroes against his entire army. The Kodos are running. Okay, home. GG. Uh, 